when you guys were talking about the phones, there's always been like that theory that once Apple comes out with the new phone, they start fucking with your old one. Right. But you had an interesting perspective on it. You were like, the battery, it was something about like the CPU yes. is going to falter if you don't. Every, every one of these crazy headlines always has both sides. And it's so easy to just look at our side, which is new phone comes out, my two sh- new phones come out, yeah. my shit gets slower, yeah. that's dumb. Okay, the other side is Apple wants, theoretically, and you have to hear this out from like, like in good faith. Okay? Yeah, 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 Apple yeah, yeah. <laughs> realizes that they want to make great phones and these batteries are not that amazing that they can hold the same voltage for years and years and years. So after a year or two, they're going to start asking less of the battery. They're gonna voltage down the CPU a little bit so that the battery can keep giving you all day battery life, but the CPU is a little slower. But now you still have all day battery on a two year old phone. Because they figure you would rather more battery than a slightly than... faster two year old phone. Now, what happens when it feels like the battery's also going away? Yeah, it will. And then your phone just feels old. Yeah. And then you hopefully, so the idea is like, get a new battery, not a whole new phone. Mm. If you need a new CPU, that's way different from just replacing the battery. Yeah. So just get a new battery, it'll feel like a new phone, maybe it, it'll start pushing the same voltages as when it was brand new, it'll be yeah. a fast phone again. Yeah. But Apple's not telling people that. Yeah. So you hear the other side, which is the headline, which is yes, your phone is actually slower. Yeah. And that sucks. <laughs> 